Hi guys. Okay. We've had quite a few kits in, so I'm gonna show you some, something else that's just come in. This is from Ming. This is the one that a lot of people have been talking about lately. This is the new Ming uh, F18E uh, Super Hornet. This is uh, 48 scale. This, uh, the reviews and that I've seen so far seem to be pretty good on the kit. Did we need another F18? Who knows, but if you're looking for a nice kit, this is really well done. The, the box is really packed to the top. So you got the usual breakdown of the way they do F-18s these days, top and bottom, uh, various fuselage parts. So there's a lot, there's a lot in it. Uh, weapons, uh, drop tanks, all sorts of things, separate bags for various bits and pieces. So you're gonna, you know, it, it, there's a lot to do in it. So it looks like it's quite a nicely detailed kit. Some of the clear parts, some of the clear parts. Uh, where's the canopy? There's the canopy. They've actually moulded it so that it's protected in, in various bits and pieces. Decal sheet and book. Uh, you also get a little bit of etched metal. Fairly big decal sheet, so quite a substantive type of series of choices of markings. They appear to be all American. Yep, they are. They're all American. Um, so if you want to you know, do a different version, you're going to have to chase some markings for it, or they may release it as a separate one later. Uh, instruction book, bit of a history of it. Quite a nice kit. Um, as I said, the reviews of the little bit of reviews I've read so far seem to be okay. Oh, there's a bunch of bunch of pins or something like that. Be careful when you open this kit. I nearly didn't know, I didn't realize that was in there. There's a little bag of pins. So obviously for holding on bits and pieces or whatever. So be careful of that when you're opening the box. So um, just yeah, watch out for that. So. This is the F-18E, nice kit, in stock, drop in and see us, and we can uh, show you that. Now that's the F-18. For the car modelers, this is the next version, or the other version of the Ming GT40. Comes in a nice little carry box, things like that. This is the pre-coloured one. Unfortunately, I'm not gonna open it. It's sealed, so I don't wanna uh, have any issues with it. The reviews and everything else I've seen, this essentially is the same car that we've seen already, but it's pre-painted. So basically take it out of the box, assemble it. Um, I think there's even some parts that are already pre-assembled. So uh, if you wanna see a, an actual review, either jump on Ming's website or uh, have a look around. I think there's a few around so far, but this is the pre-colored one. So if you're looking for that a little easier, a nice body finish, things like that, Grab this one. It is more expensive than the standard one. I think it's in the seven, eight hundred dollar mark. But if your time doesn't want to be spent, or you just want to build that kit that you just want to put on the shelf and of a beautiful car, um, come and see us. Pick one up. Other than that, that's it for today. See you then. Bye.